He's Superman on us. <laughs> He's Superman on us. I hit him with this. I ain't even sure to him when they walk in the door. That's all right, though. All right, man. <clears throat> Let me clear my throat. And we are back in the building. Family, yep, yep. what's happening, man? This is the Legend Has It podcast. If you did not know, thank you for tuning in once again. My name is Art Work. Bo in the building. And I am C Bodie. What's going on, fellas? Ain't nothing happening, man. What's good? Chilling, man. I ain't damn. Somebody at the door. Ain't that a bitch. Let me turn that down. <laughs> um, my bad. Uh, yeah, I'm feeling good, man. Feeling great. Feeling real good, bro. Feeling real good. Why is that, man? You just. This is, uh. uh <clears throat> I ain't expect to be here tonight. That's why I'm feeling extra good. It's one of them had other commitments. That's what's up. One man. of them last minute. Let's go knock it out. Yeah, man. Um, how was y'all holiday, man? Holla, y'all might not see this in no time soon, but I just want to ask y'all. Turkey Day just passed. How was y'all? Y'all holiday? Y'all y'all spending with fam or y'all? Mine was excellent. But yeah, I did. I did get to spend time with the fam, mom, pops, sisters, brother-in-law, nieces, nephews. Ate good. Everybody good, man. No, I'm saying y'all ate good though, right? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. So you know we had the uh, fried turkey. Yeah, man. So you already know fried turkey is superior. Do you eat turkey? You do? I prefer it fried. Yeah, yeah. Fried turkey is superior to um a regular dry ass turkey. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I eat that too, but But I ain't had no um I ain't had no ham this year. I don't know if y'all eat ham. You know I don't. I'm not a fan of ham. And didn't have um we didn't have fried turkey because we wasn't gonna do nothing. It was thinking it ended up being last minute because like my grandfather was not doing well, and then he came. He, he was in the hospital for like a week or two, and he he been home for like a week or two now. And they was like, "Well, we need to do something because you know he might not make it for another Thanksgiving." So they threw it together at the last minute. So it was I enjoyed myself. That's good, man. For me, Thanksgiving is um, and I've done this several years. <laughs> you say you haven't done it in several years? No, I'm saying I've done what I'm about to tell y'all. Like I, 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 I was invited to like multiple places, but I decided just to chill at the crib. And I've done this for like I don't know. Thanksgiving's been coming one of them holidays where I just like to just lounge and do nothing, and that's what it is. I want to send a shout out to uh, the Bodie family for the plate because. Uh, he brought me and Raul a plate, and he came sure. right on time because <laughs> <laughs> I was starving. That's crazy. But yeah, he came right on time. It was good, man. I, I appreciate that. But you know, I know you saying you like to be, you know, what I'm saying at the crib <laughs> chilling or whatnot. But th- that's honestly, after we ate, that's all we did. Like we ate, and we watched football, and you know, everybody was just lounging. I mean by myself. Uh, <laughs> I feel you. <laughs> See, I I feel you though. I might I might be envious of your situation because this probably is an unpopular opinion, but I really don't give a damn about Thanksgiving. If I you don't wanna eat. I if mean, you wanna eat, we can eat. Can eat it ain't got to be this Thursday that we decide we're gonna eat Not but at all. That's the extra. Thing. Yeah, that's, I, I agree <clears> with that. But I think what it is is because it's like a set. It's a set that people are off work. off work Exactly Yeah and, and that's when And a lot of people Don't make certain things A priority You know what I mean Like you, let's say We're gonna June something We're gonna throw a cookout here You know It probably ain't gonna It ain't gonna go as planned You kinda gotta make it Like a Like your Brother-in-law's Family did You kinda gotta make it Like a 
a traditional thing yeah. for it to be something important to people. Like, oh, this is every year, this date or this we this we weekend, doing. we all going to get together. And a lot of people don't, like you, know you said, don't, say it ain't got to be Thanksgiving. Yeah. Don't make it a priority, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Unless it's dictated by an already put together tradition. And I think that's unfortunate, but that's just the way the society is, you know. Like you said, people get off work and that's the yeah. time. That's convenient. Yep. You know what I'm saying? So. I'm going to chill. Yeah, I understand that. I did eat well though. I ate very well. I ate probably so well, cause too well, cause I ain't even drink Thursday. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you ate good. I man. was like, I ain't, I don't, no, nah, I don't want that. Yeah, I ain't, I ain't drink. I'm sit here, I'm f- too full for anything else. Is it a? Uh, let me ask y'all a question. Is it a food on Thanksgiving you got to have? Like it's some on Thanksgiving you got to have when it comes to food. I mean, if, uh, nah, because I'm happy to have anything <laughs> the way I do it. But <laughs> I would like to what have. Would you like to have um, fried turkey, <laughs> uh, baked macaroni and cheese. Man, I just I, I like baked macaroni. That was, was gonna be my some good baked macaroni and cheese is always. Um, it's always a plus. Yeah, I feel you. That's well, that's exactly what I was gonna say. You bake macaroni. They bake macaroni, yeah. man. I got I don't know, something about it. Yeah. So yeah. That's one thing I got to have. But you buddy? Don't I don't really have something that I'm like if we don't have it, I ain't gonna be happy. I'm always interested to see what's what's for dessert though. I mean, I ain't gonna lie, cause you don't, you never know who might pop up with what. I used to be a big sweet potato pie fan, but now nah, I ain't got nothing that out. Things getting one right, cause I ain't get you know what I'm saying. Mm-hmm. I ain't I ain't got one of them. Hey, like with these traditions and holidays, right? I I typically don't celebrate. <laughs> Holidays like that, I, you know what I'm saying. Like, I mean, I fall in line because the people that my friends and families they do it, so it's kind of like it's hard not to like <clears throat> fall in line sometimes. But so any like holiday that y'all look forward to throughout the year, or it's just whatever. It used to be Christmas for me, but now my son is damn near grown, so. That took the the excitement out of it, cause like ain't nothing like seeing them trying to figure out what they got going on up under that tree. But now I guess mm, I consider my birthday a holiday. Yeah, same. My birthday and New Year's maybe same. New Year's because you live to see a new year. Yeah, and yeah. I see what's getting ready to happen in this new year. See how much better I can get than I was before. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But no, nah, other than that, I'm, mm, I don't really care about Fourth of July. It's too damn hot. Uh, yeah, I don't even care about that one. Like I said, Thanksgiving ain't that exciting to me. Mm. Yeah, my birthday and New Year's. Well, for me, coming up, Christmas was my favorite holiday. Christmas was everybody's, you know, especially coming as a kid. Coming you know home, up. But then, like, either like, but now I like still like Christmas though. I just because it's a different type of feel you get around the Christmas time. And I hate Christmas. You hate Christmas. Yes, I hate this time of year. I hate Damn. all the crowds. I'm yeah, like, I hate that, I'm but I don't be going out like that. I'm, if I'm shopping, you nine times out of ten, it's online. Yeah, you I'm ain't sure. got to be shopping. Yeah, though. that's what I'm saying. You can be on your trying to get to where you need to go, and it's just like I don't even if you if you ventured out on like Wednesday and Thursday of this week, traffic was crazy. Yeah, definitely, Wednesday. and I couldn't even figure out like where y'all going. <laughs> It's just overkill. Just like when they send us shortage in food and stuff, it'd be like that. They're going shopping. But the grocery stores be ridiculous, man. Going shopping. 
Even though it's in, inflation is super crazy, everybody still we still shopping. So it's. Oh, you ain't gonna spend that money. Yeah, I don't care. But yeah, I don't. I don't really like this time of year, man. This shit is uh, brings me down. It's depressing to me, and it shouldn't be, but it is. Motherfucker is expensive. I tell you that, and it shouldn't be that either. I mean, it, it, ain't, it shouldn't be that like that, but it is. And like you were saying about the, the traffic and the crowds or whatever, I don't know what it is, but Thanksgiving, I always end up in the grocery store Thursday morning. Mm. I feel like my, something. I feel like my mom been forgetting something on purpose since I got my license, and it's still hey. Need you to go get such such. All right. That's yeah. how my mom used to be. You know, if I was some at home, stores, it'd be some. Yeah, some stores they they done adjusted their hours, so it's it don't matter if what time you go, it's gonna be right. packed. You know, you might have to walk from here to ain't no telling how far. Another you gotta park park yeah, you gotta park across <laughs> the street to get in the grocery <laughs> store. But yeah, so I mean that's it's something I don't adapt to. It's, it's something that I'm like, well, no, I gotta go to the store. Cause like I'll call her she, I'll call her Before she called me Be like What'd you forget I ain't really forget Nothing But I do I do want need, need. <laughs> Some eggs Yeah if you don't mind <laughs> Pulling up to the store And getting such and such I Have a gallon of milk I can do this With that And I'm like Alright yeah, Let me ask y'all This me And I hate Christmas I but I do have on Christmas colors But that's beside the point Oh <laughs> 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 uh, like y'all live living in close proximity to y'all y'all families, your mother in particular, right? Mm-hmm. And I don't, you know what I'm saying? So it's like I remember that when I was when I did live, you know, when I was younger and right. I lived like that. But I've I haven't been I've been away from home since I was seventeen. So it's like I kinda miss that because I see y'all, you can see your mother like anytime, pull up on them. Mm-hmm. Boom, and I, you know, I gotta like Take a trip Take a trip You know what I'm saying So how um, Could y'all see that Any other way Or Being that it's been like that Has it been like that for y'all Pretty much your whole life Pretty much Yeah Every Thanksgiving Pretty much every Christmas too For me I'm just talking about Regular life Like just Oh you're talking about Regular Yeah just being Daily basis Yeah just being able to see them Like whenever Like in, in Close proximity yeah, it's been like that so long. I don't think I could. It would have to be something major for me to make that change. Because, mm-hmm. especially now, it, she getting up in age or whatever. So, I I need to be around just so I can. Not even make sure she's straight, but because she ain't gonna, she ain't gonna ask me to do but so much, but. At least I can offer. Be like, hey, can I, what you need? Such and such, such, go sit down. So, I mean, but now I don't, not now. It's been too long now. Ain't no need of me trying to. Like I said, it would be something major. It'd be, it had to be a crazy dollar amount. Yeah, I feel <clears throat> And even then, you still be able to, have to be real quick to get back. He ain't got to be quick. I just got to have the freedom to get back. Like, like find find out I can get. I need to be there tomorrow. I need to be able to leave today. Yeah, I don't need to have to make no arrangements. And like, if the majority of my family is in that close area, it's like very few of us that like some left and came back. So it's a lot of my family that's in the like that in that reach. So it's yeah. It, It'd be hard. I ain't do it when I was younger, so it'd be real hard to do it now. Yo, come on, bro. I thought I'd turn this shit off. <laughs> but yeah, I agree with you, Bodie. I've been, yeah, ever since ever since I graduated high school, even with me moving, I've been within 30 minutes to my, you know, my mom. And now within, you know, what, five to seven now. So it's been... It definitely would be hard for me to move away 
why I got, you know what I'm saying? I got to take a flight or whatever. But I don't know. Easy. I just see people, like everybody I pretty much, like a lot of my friends, um, save a few that live here. They all, their families are all like <clears throat> close by, you know what I'm saying? And I think that makes you like closer to your family or whatever. And so I'm kind of like distant and I can tell like my distance, like when I, Around my family You know what I'm saying Because I You feel out the loop Yeah Out the loop And I'm such a But it's what's crazy though Some of your family Could still be right Around you And you still so distant You know what I mean Like I got some family That's real You know Close cousins But we don't never see each other You know what I'm saying Yeah Okay And we right Around the corner You know what I mean Yeah I got the same situation too And I I know you were saying with us, with your family being close or whatever, it ain't always a good thing. Oh, I know that. Because yeah. it's part of the reason why. It's going to be parts of the family. <laughs> parts of the family ain't going to be right. Yeah, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it's you a like, yeah, you yeah. I'm going to be like, man, man, I had to come over into this still. Yeah, this what y'all doing today? So, I mean, it's, it has its pros and its cons. Yeah, I can see that. Yeah, it was just something that I thought about on the, on the fly. You know what and I'm saying? I so got, I, to go along with it, too, I got, like, cousins that's... I got cousins in Texas. And we ain't never really been in the same area. But I feel like I'm close to them. Like, they've been here my whole life. Like, I can go there right now, and we're going to... Rock just like we did the last time we seen each other. Y'all talk much in between? Yeah. Oh, okay. We got like a little text thread. It's two girls, too. That's the crazy part. <laughs> I talk to them all the time. Like, I, it, them, it's, it's funny because you have that, them, and you'd be like, I wish they was here because I could, ain't no telling what type of relationship we would have had, but mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying? But then it's, I had them here too. And then I, it, you, get, you get friends that become family. So I mean it's it's a whole it's different. I think I'm um in 2022. I think I'm gonna make a, a effort to reach out more and be more sociable because you know y'all know how I am. Yeah, I, yeah. Um, I like to be by myself and all that. <laughs> but I got like siblings. I don't really know like that. You know what I'm saying? I got two sisters in particular that I want to kind of get to know a little better that we don't really talk to. And I'm probably going to try to I am going to try to make an effort to do better yeah, yeah, You know what I'm saying Because yeah. I am bad about that Like it's I'm terrible I say it out of that. mind You know what I'm saying I'm So it's terrible. like Terrible And this life is short So I kind of got to Adjust myself And change a little bit To Build like, relationships Yeah And what's crazy It's not like you don't think about that person It's just It's you, just You don't life. take the you life, know, yeah, yeah, it's yeah, life It's just you're life busy You're working yeah. You're trying to Grind, you trying to get to the next step in your life. And then a lot of times, I think I felt like, because um, my mom used to get on me, you know, you should call such and such. I'm like, man, why is the onus on me? They got a phone, you can call me, but now I'm like, okay, I'll, I'll do my part, you know what I'm saying? So, anyway, that's something I thought about, man. Y'all have, hope everybody had a wonderful turkey day and have a wonderful, wonderful whatever this holiday is coming up, man. Yeah. Yo, so you were saying that you had like cousins, right, in Texas. Mm-hmm. And that you um uh, like they have you ever visited them? Would you fly out to that's, them? That's that's the crazy thing. Life. <clears throat> oh, okay. But I was asking because I mean you had brought up like the topic of like being flewed out, flying out, not just say <laughs> with your cousins. I'm just trying to like <laughs> transition. Um but would you let a let a lady fly you out if you were single? Mm. Fly you out? I would not. If not, why not? One thing. Hear me out. I know I think different. <laughs> we're gonna have to. I would really have to. We we have to be some FaceTime. Not just no messages or whatever. I got to make sure I ain't being catfish, catfish. first of all. Because, 
You know what I'm saying? They be like, yo, I don't need you. Come on out here. And then you get there and you be like, whoa. This is not what I was <laughs> Who is this? <laughs> What's your name again? You know, but yeah, I mean, we got, and then on but top you get of that. A expense fa- paid trip. That don't account for nothing. It don't because you at the mercy of this person too. Your your expense paid trip might be on spirit. Nah, man. I'm be hating on spirit. Cause nah, fuck that. <laughs> You get, you, yeah, just go to the airport. I got your <clears throat> ticket, and you get there, and you find out you got three layovers, and <laughs> you gonna get that tomorrow. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be all kind of crazy because you, I mean, you you really at they. Nah, I, you gotta send me the itinerary. Yeah, because I mean, it's mm, like I said, I got to see this person. We gotta be, we gotta be damn near. So you gotta know her. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, yeah. So it's not like. Not like how I imagine what chicks be being flued out is. Yeah, like how yeah. certain, not know. all, but certain chicks get flued out yeah. by pictures. Yeah, off based off Instagram posts, mm-hmm. right? From guys that got it like that. Yeah, <clears throat> for lack of a better word or phrase. Um, <clears throat> so you are saying it might be different for a male and getting flued out. <laughs> Definitely. But guys get catfish too. Those guys. I mean, I seen a um, post the other day, and I can't remember where it's from because I just I don't be clicking on shit. But I seen like the caption. It was like the dude. He sent her back because she was a catfish. He was like, "Yo, your body is not the same as these pictures." He sent her back. Yeah, he was that's like, why yeah, you gotta go. So I said, I can't rock. I ain't rocking just based off what I seen in the pictures. We we gonna have to have <laughs> zoom memes, yeah, all kind of <laughs> s- something. <laughs> and, and while we talking on this zoom, I need to put your ID up, yeah, make sure I'm talking to the right person. Write your name, all kind of stuff, and hold it up while I can see it. Cause look, you, yeah. it. Cause you know how people man, they'll be them put their friend up there to talk to you till yeah. you get there, and they be like, "Well, I ain't think you would come if." So, 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 it's you know, like the show Catfish. Y'all yeah, ever watch yeah, Catfish? Yeah, exactly. I know what it is. But, like, that show can't be real, can it? Like, do people I, actually get, like, catfish I, that I bad? Do. I, I do. I do. What do you think? You got to think about it. Because people Con- is looking for. What do you think contributes to that? Like, getting, like, there, you think it's them being. I know it's not Eva Tay, right? Yeah. But. Also, is it like desperateness? Like they really want to believe that this person is loneliness. Also, we talked about this thing right here it making you lazy or dumb. <laughs> I ain't gonna say they lazy or dumb, but this played a major part in yeah. that catfish taking place. You ain't want to go outside and meet people the normal way. But sometimes people are awkward, right? Yeah, and they have social anxiety or whatever they got. Or they might be insecure, and that's an easier way to meet people for some people, right? But my th- where I'm baffled at is when people. So I seen a catfish episode, and this chick really thought she was talking to. I think it was Bow Wow. Mm-hmm. And I, was, in my mind, I'm like, you know, Shorty, <laughs> you know, Shorty, no. Bow Wow. And this was like when Bow Wow was like, Bow Wow, Bow like he was more popping like than he is now. So it's Bow Wow. It's like you know what I'm saying. Like it's like. I hope you don't he, see this. He gonna be hating on you. I mean, not, I'm not. I'm just saying. Yeah, like, I, you, I know what you're saying. You know what I'm saying. I'm not hating. You know, you know what I'm saying. He, he still. He still. He, he you think know, he whatever. popping? He doing what he. You know. <laughs> I'm just saying. It's Bow Wow. She really was believing that, and she wanted to believe that. She mm-hmm. couldn't like wrap her mind around that it wasn't. It's like, bro, you know that's not fucking Bow Wow. Like, you ain't got no real friends because your real friends would have been like, that's why I say I think, it, bitch, <laughs> you know that well. It's not Bow Wow. Yeah. But that's why I say I think it goes back to being lonely, man. Yeah, I think it is. I think it does too. And be and seeking, or maybe even trying to you know seek attention or love or companionship. Or yeah, yeah, some type companionship. of companionship. Some type of companionship because I think it, it's the loneliness mixed with the. 
awkwardness of your personality where you have kind of like social anxiety yeah. and like shy and 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 it's 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 a whole lot easier to I ain't even gonna say carry a relationship but build a relationship with somebody that you don't actually talk to you could tell them anything you want to through whatever type of email text message DM whatever you're doing you I mean, you could say whatever, and they it ain't it'll come across the way they want it to come across. You can't get away with that when you actually talking to somebody. I'm talking about like face to face. Yeah, not yeah. even face to face, but your voice oh. ain't gonna give what you giving. Give the words yeah, to so the vocal inflections. Ain't, yeah, you know what I'm saying. Just yeah. you can interpret text however you want to interpret right. text, <clears throat> and like okay, I got. And you. if they really wanna, they really want everything to be. Just as beautiful as they can imagine it, it don't make no difference what you say. They gonna that's how they gonna see it. Yeah, yeah, I feel you on that. So I mean, it's I don't know, man. I just and they make it so easy for, like you were saying, the naive people to get taken advantage of because mm-hmm. they set up. It's probably a million different websites you can go to and just talk to a stranger and. The stranger and said the right thing to you for three days, and now you love them. <laughs> so, I mean, yeah, that's I don't true. Know. All right, getting back to the question with, all right, so, so you, you wouldn't fly a chick out without. No, oh, me, you wouldn't me let a chick flying you out. Yeah, you wouldn't, out. Yeah, you wouldn't. Yeah, you wouldn't get flued out and, um, <laughs> without the proper uh, credentials in place. Well, now, with you. In return, yeah. If you if you you know had the means to do that, whenever you wanted to do See, that, that's, that's the it go <clears throat> right back to that because she might be hitting you with some stuff. You be like, oh yeah. But this type of thing happens all the time. I so know. I better do. Just saying. But like, then when she get there, you she don't look like what you thought she was gonna. Look even like. if. She did the way I nah, think, but you don't did your due diligence, so you don't went through like every every nook, nook and cranny. Yeah, every social she got. The way I'm the way I'm looking at it, <clears throat> you don't ran the background check right <laughs> now. With the mind frame that I have, I ain't flying nobody out because <laughs> if I got the the means to do that, I should be able to find exactly what I'm flying out. Within my, you know, not my area, but I can venture out and find what I'm looking for without having to fly somebody from across wherever. Well, I go there and see what's popping in your city. And if you ain't right, you're going to see me on my gram with whoever I did come across. You know what I mean? Yeah, but I think people that do that do have those means a lot of times. But they just, it's convenience and it's, they just want the one it's, they want. Yeah, it's much easier. And then they just saw it. Yeah. Um, no, man. It's the one I'm stuck on right here. I need to, I gotta, I need, I gotta yeah, I need to, she need take to take this all the way out. Pull you know? up. I don't see it because I don't, it's something like something else. I don't know if y'all notice it or not, but it seems. To me, it, well, it appears to me, once you reach a certain amount of celebrity, you dealing with the same people. So you might see, like, if say we were three people that somehow came famous, and we say we were just associates, but I would, they probably, you, I would probably be dating somebody Art used to talk to no, you a couple. Of, that's how, if you look at it. Certain ones do, do, yeah, they do do yeah, that. You, you, you know what I mean? see you would be like, they same they in the same going, circle. Yeah, they do. But that's why you got to, that travel venture out, and then you got to find that one. And I don't, and I don't understand that because I, I don't know if they need somebody, they feel like they need somebody that is sort of on their level or, or what? what is it? I don't know because I don't want nobody you didn't. Nah, for what? I mean... <laughs> You ever had that one? Yeah, yeah, okay. Good. good job, Mike. Yeah. <laughs> we good. Yeah. <clears throat> I don't know what that is. I don't, I don't. I think it's just the circles that intermingle. You know, when you get to that, I think we see a lot of celebrities do that. I don't know if that's like, it's like 
like unfamous rich people do that. I doubt it. Yeah. I think it's just that we see the the celebrity. Who we see. Yeah, yeah. it's just that you but see I bet the it celebrity. Is a lot of yeah. yeah, I mean, I don't know, man. It's like um, I think it's the, the for, for, forbidden fruit, um, logic, kinda. Yeah. It's I like get. you know what I'm saying. Like you want what you can't have, and I think it's some of that going on with that. But I don't know. Um. Would I fly a chick out, man? I don't think. I don't. I'm cool. So you cool? Yeah, I think I'm so you, cool. So what if you just, you know, you just know your bag is so different right now. You just like... I'm cool on that. What if you just, you know, let me have some fun. Cool on that. Well, you know, you can have fun. You ain't got to fly them out to have fun. You can say, oh, meet me in... Um, <laughs> it's a location. Yeah, central to the both of us. Yeah, we yes. gonna go to the. Um, yeah, because Fluid Money is a big or uh, whatever the event is that's, that's going on this week. Meet me out at uh, what's the shit you want? What's the shit in Mexico? Oh yeah, where you Tulum? Tulum. Yeah, Tulum. Yeah, meet me out in Tulum. We gonna. Ain't nobody gonna let me out. We there. gonna all your friends. I don't know where you out there. We can turn up for a weekend. I can go about my business, and you can go about your business. Do it like that. Yeah, man. Well, flying a chick I ain't flying you out so to my man. house, man. I don't no, know. not you your know. house. Definitely not yeah. that. Yeah. I only want you in my city where I live at. Not the house. It's going to take a long time for you to come to my house. Yeah. You flying somebody out, Mike? Or would you be flued out? Nah, I ain't being flued out. I ain't even try to Uber nobody out. Yeah, I ain't even. Nah, we ain't, we ain't even doing that. <laughs> I can't. I can't depend on. You know what I mean? I just can't do that. I can't. I ain't gonna even feel right. I don't know what I'm walking into. You're putting your piece on the line doing that. Yeah, it's like a slippery slope when you don't really know. Now they inside your domain, and they can say anything. Pull any type of card. You now the extortions at play. And then on top of that, I know you've seen <laughs> like stories where people been flown out, and they was flown out, and they basically went with nothing, and it didn't work out the way they had planned, and they can't even get home. So that's another thing. I, I mean. If I did say, all right, yeah, yeah buy uh, me a ticket, I, I got to be gotta right. Some yeah, type you gotta, I got to be plan. right. I'm going to be right As when a man, I, get I would that. hope you would have some type of, like, means of your own yeah, to, like... <laughs> you this don't work out, I can get me a room. Yeah. I ain't going out there just based off my off my own stroke game. Like, I seen stories of people my, having to sleep in the airport. My stroke game might not work. Pumps. Yeah, them sturdy pumps <laughs> might be the gummy worm. <laughs> now, 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 now I'm, what you doing? Yeah, yeah, I'm out on the street. Mm-hmm. You whole, coming out with a gummy worm, you getting? Uh, <laughs> yeah, I'm. I'm getting. I'm in on the street in a whole another city. You even got flew out. Gummy worm in it. <laughs> <laughs> Came out there with no means to get back to what I need to get back to. Can't even get a cheeseburger. Yeah, you got. You betting on yourself. You yeah. like uh. That would be bad. You like what's my name? Name Miles Bridges. You got to bet on yourself. You got to go put up thirty and ten. I'm telling you. In that man. box. <laughs> Join that right. So you can move in. <laughs> Just let me stay out here. Yeah. Move in with you. I'm about to I'm live out here now. We yeah. go together now. We go together. <laughs> you mind. Yeah, man. I don't know. I ain't trying to fly nobody out. I ain't trying to really get food out, like you said, unless I really, you know, if I know you like that. We got history. You got no, yeah, I was say you got to have some got history. Some history. You got to be known yeah, for a sure. while. And then at this day and age, you think about it, somebody fly you, fly you out, and you they setting you up for the okie doke. So tell them what happened when you get there. It's always a risk. It's a risk with anything, though. Just gotta you know take the calculated risk. Yeah, but it's a different risk. I'm going to a strange place, to see this strange person. I don't know what they got going on. Yeah. <laughs> they can set you up any kind of way they want to. Yeah, you can't have when you fly out. You live in a different state. You can't take the 
Mm-hmm. The burning with you, so mm-hmm. you you <laughs> you butt naked. Yeah, you butt naked out yeah. here. You might get butt naked literally. But, you know what <laughs> so yeah, gotta be careful out there. Be careful. Catfish is real. Think about what you. Y'all ever been catfish? You get to know what you're doing, who you nah, doing nah. before you accept that flight. <laughs> so you know what you're getting into. Yeah, cause I mean. Cause I well I have seen some that they act like it was the best thing ever, but I seen a whole lot of horror stories too. Like it was one chick I can't remember. She it's like she got a dude had another chick at the house or something crazy like what his, got, his yeah. baby mama or something like oh, that. Okay. He was expecting her to fall in line. Yeah, <clears throat> she thought it was what it wasn't. He ended up at the. She ended up sleeping at the airport. She ain't got no money for no ticket. She just out there. See that's see that's, that's the, the yeah. See that to me that's being irresponsible. Mm-hmm. Being irresponsible, man. Now, if you know you ain't got no money, even though that, like you feel like you should never be powerless in a situation, right? Correct. So you should go into it like right, if you're getting paid for. Okay, that's cool. But I got my own. In case things, in happen. case shit just fall apart, you know what I'm saying. You never know. hundred percent. Nah, get there. People show you their good side first. Anyway, you get there, and it's just a whole another different side of a person you ain't never seen. You like, oh hell no, I got to get the fuck on about my business. Mm-hmm. You can't because you ain't got no money. That's all. That's a, <clears throat> you should always at least have your way back. That's a bad situation. People do that though. People put their shit on the line just to go have fun. And don't be happy. <laughs> I think we talked about that. Motherfuckers go on vacation. <laughs> oh, don't have no money. Nothing. Why would you do that? I don't know. I don't understand. I mean, that. because you're going on vacation to have fun, right? Mm-hmm. You can't have no fun if you ain't got no damn money. Unless you're going to finesse. What's it? I'll tell you what, I don't, I don't like that. I don't like it either, but people do that. They'll go and be like, man. I figure out this. Let go and let God. <laughs> I'll be like, nah, that ain't what God's for, yo. Nah. You got <laughs> Cause how can you plan something? Like we can't you can't plan I'm yeah. we gonna go to here. It don't work like that. You know what I'm saying? You like well, we can figure out. But that now they leaning on the whole crew. That's terrible, man. Man, y'all stop living like that. <laughs> Especially if you grown, man. Yeah, you grown, just say you can't go. I can't do it. I can't do it, man. I gotta. We're gonna wait till next guy. You can't go. And it don't hurt to be to miss a trip. You can't go on every trip. You can't do everything everybody else do. That ain't possible. Everybody can't go all the time. Think it's FOMO though. Hmm? Man, like, damn that fear yeah, of missing out. It, it is because I mean, it's been times where I. Could have went, but I knew it wasn't a smart thing for me to do, so I chilled. <clears throat> Yo, speaking of vacations, man, so we was talking, like, before the cameras came on about, I think you said something about, like, what's something you look forward to, and you <clears throat> said traveling. Yeah. And I was telling y'all, like, how I get when, like, I got a trip plan. Like, I'm always, like, anxious, and I don't be wanting to go. Like, I'll agree to some shit, and then I'll be like, the closer it get, I'll be like, damn, man, why did I say I want to go on this shit? Nah. I'm... And then I'll be like, but when I get there, I'll be cool. Like, all that shit go away. I was like, damn, So it's like the, the, the travel part? From I don't know what it beat. is. It's just like, I don't be wanting to go. I just be wanting to, like, man, I'd rather just stay here. And then once I get there, it's like, ah, shit, I'm cool, man. This shit, I had fun. <laughs> <laughs> Glad I came. <laughs> But most of the time, when something's coming up that's planned ahead of time, I think it's the planning ahead of time. I'm so damn, what is the word, man? I'm unorthodox. You think you're spontaneous? And, nah, I'm not really. I'm kind of spontaneous, but I'm more of a like a procrastinator. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Last minute. Yeah, so it's like when it's planned, it's like, man, I feel like I, I, uh, just made an early commitment and I ain't think it through sometimes. Right. You know yeah. what I'm saying? So I'm like indecisive sometimes. And it's like, man, I don't want to do this shit. 
and I'm a homebody, so it's like, man, I don't really want to do this. But then once I get there, it's like, ah, oh, man, this is cool. Glad I came. Yeah, man. Hey, I look, I look forward to going on vacation now. Yeah, Especially when you're going to somewhere different, you ain't been, you ain't seen, or. And planning it make it easier in the it, long It does. Run. It really does. But I don't know. It fucks with my anxiety for some reason. I don't know why. Like you can have everything taken care of before you even leave out the door. That made the vacation even better. Yeah. <laughs> Ten times better. So all you got to worry about is like how you going to eat. Sometimes yep. you ain't got to worry about that. If it's mm-hmm. depending planning, where you going. Yeah, depending planning, on where you're right. at. Just worry about the extracurriculars. It's, like, it's just pull up and let's get it. Yeah. And that's that's great, especially when you're with the right people. Yeah, that helped too. A lot. With that, you ever been somewhere and you was like, yo, I shouldn't have came? Yeah. <laughs> that might be the reason, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I shouldn't have. I sh- I whole time, the house. damn, I shouldn't have did this. <laughs> it was a bad move. This shit just get progressively worse. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's like, it's like, and it'll be bad because you'll be like, all right, this, the day is over with. Tomorrow's a new day. <laughs> You're trying to be positive. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Go have a good time tomorrow. And it'd be, nah. Same shit. person. Yeah, something different. Getting ready to throw the whole thing off. That's, that might be part of my problem because I don't <clears> like, <throat> I think I got a four-day max on being away from the crib. Ooh. I got a three day. Three days? Yeah, I gave it four because it usually end up being by the third day, I'll be ready. A to night, go. a day, a night, a day, and then it'd be another. You ready to go home? Yeah. Oh, no, yeah. no, no, no. I'll be ready to go, bro. I no, get somewhere, no. bro. I'll be like, all right, man, I'm cool on this shit. No. I'm ready to get shoot. back to my Two, bed. Three days, I'm just getting into it. Nah, I'm ready to get like, back I to my bed, fam. I can't. I can't if you had, hold on. If you had a right, the right hotel, would that be it right? I still Sh- shower right. I still man. It's something about home that just I don't know. I, I'm with you on that, but I can I can do a six seven day. I can't fathom that. I think I'd go crazy for real. I did a five day cruise. Now, I've never, I never done that with my family before, and that was cool. But I still was ready. Get back home, but it was cool. This shit was, it had fun. But by the third so day, so could you do different places? Like, let's say, okay, let's say you're gone for seven days, right? Let's say you do three or four in Miami, and then you went somewhere else for the next three days. Could you do that, or are you still like, shit, now nah, I'm ready to go home? I could do that, but I'm saying I'm still gonna be ready to go home, probably. I'm gonna be like, man, I right, this is cool, but I. Right. But if I had to do it, then yeah, I'd do it. If like if my my business, my work. No, we're talking about leisure. Are oh, you talking about leisure? Yeah, I could do it. Cause like you said, like the people you with make it better too. Yeah. If you with the right people, that doesn't negate the fact that I still be like, damn man, I'm ready to get home. What's my bed, man? Cause you know what it is with me, I can't take a shit in like strange places. <laughs> it's hard for me to take. Like I got like. What's like, it called? I feel, I feel like exactly, shit phobia. I feel exactly what you're I talking about. I can't take about. comfortable shit in like a strange place that I, you know what I'm saying? My feeling. I, I have the same problem. So by the time I get home, I'll I be didn't, backed up. I didn't, know it was a, <laughs> I didn't know it was a thing, but I have the same problem. It's a thing, but I mean, nah, as long as it's, as long as it's clean, we're going forward. I can't, I had a trouble. I be proud of myself when I get one off and I'm out. For however many days I'd be like Well you did it <laughs> <laughs> Me too man It's rare bro I'll be in there Try That shit though Just though I don't know what it is man That shit is weird man I don't know I don't know why That's like that it's, I, I got like it. some type of Mental block with it like, This is kind of disgusting But that'd be the first thing that, As soon as I get to the house Yeah that's what I do Drop the bags at the door I'm <laughs> in the bathroom time tell to go. Him. That might be a mental thing It is It's some type of mental it block It is Some people can just Whatever They like They ready to let Yeah it. I can't do it that is. I'm, Cause I'm a big Germ I'm, I became a big germaphobe And I don't think This pandemic helped At all So Cause If you really think about 
the stuff that you seeing that people how nasty people are now that you weren't paying attention to before. Yeah. So that's I mean, so I think that probably made it worse for me. Nah, no, mine was always bad. I like, used to think about it, but now I know it would be ten times worse when I go wherever I go. Mm-hmm. I'm like, yo, and twelve t- hour shifts at what you call it? Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's. Yeah, I have to be done. I got to be about to shit on myself <laughs> before sweet. I go to the that is, that is me. <laughs> I can't that do it, bro. Me. I cannot do it. And then I got to find like a, the most ducked off spot. Yeah, the most ducked off spot where like the less people come in. I, I mm. can't do it, bro. Yep. I don't know what it is. It's a, oh, it's a yeah. It's, it's, I'm going to let that go. It's, it's two of them that I will visit, but it's very rare that I visit. I'll tell y'all where they at off camera, but yeah, I, I got the same. I know exactly what you're talking about, and I can be in there. My stomach doing jumping jacks. And like, Are you stealing? Nah. Oh no, nah, I can't. I can't even do that. Mm. So y'all just y'all like this all day. Because if I go, I can't. It won't. It won't nothing happen, bro. I can't do yeah, it. That, that's a mental block. I be in there. What do they call that I, shit? I, I walk around farting all yeah, the time. Yeah, what, what they call that shit? Sharecropping? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, you don't want to sharpen. You know? I go around sharecropping. I will do what? Walking down that long aisle? <laughs> like, damn, whoever come behind me, bro, they get the oh, in for a treat. Man. All right, we about to get off this. I know this is yeah, crazy. It's disgusting. Hey, but look, I remember when I was in there one time, and I was over there. <laughs> I was at my piece of my machinery. And I had just let one, it was the most flagrant <laughs> joint. And the plant manager walks up, he in my face talking to me. I'm like, He was eating it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was like, Yeah. <laughs> nice seeing you. I was like, man, damn. My bad, bro. That is the worst, though. <laughs> yeah. Man, you got to get out of there. Yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You have it, man. Here at the Legend Has a Podcast, you never know what you're going to get out of us. This is, man, pertinent information. I mean, it happens. Yeah, it does. You know what I'm saying? Take it with a grain of salt. Gems we dropping over here. Yo. This ain't no rap, G. I told you that. Hey. But well, yo, I was we was just talking about um shit in public places. <laughs> How hey, disgusting. Got, hey, we're sorry. How disgusting. Yeah, I pardon us. Pardon us. Um, I'm so sorry. Um do y'all have any like secrets that y'all carry with y'all today? You don't got to tell them, but like any secrets that y'all carry? You know what I'm saying? Because that could have been like I could we could have kept that to ourselves, and you know what I'm saying? That could have been a secret. You know, but, on, <clears throat> on Legend has a podcast. You know, and that's really a secret. You know, we just let everything out. Yeah, I'm saying personally though. Do you like you do have any like some shit that you wouldn't even dare telling anybody? Yeah. <laughs> of course <laughs> Yeah Matter of fact It ain't none of y'all been Nah but yeah I Had some of those Yeah like I, I feel said. as if it's Some things are Necessary to Keep, to, keep yourself. to yourself I got some shit that Probably I might need therapy for Right I ain't even saying <clears throat> I, ain't, I don't even I ain't trying to cut you off but no, go ahead. let me finish my what I was saying because I'll be done forgot by go the time ahead, you finish. My bad. But I feel like it's certain stuff you should keep to yourself because everybody not gonna look at it the same way you look at it. True. Like it's some shit that I really don't give a fuck about. But I think some people that I care about might judge me for it. So before I get to the point where I let them judge me for it. You just keep it ain't none up. of your business. It's, it's this is for me, and I think we all have those type of situations where I ain't gonna let you know what everything to go on with me or what I'm doing or shouldn't. Yeah, you like but, I got to keep some stuff to myself. But even I'm talking about okay, so between amongst us, that's a given, right? But what if it's somebody like you, your significant other? Would you tell them certain shit that? You might feel like other people would judge you for, or would you just keep that to yourself also? So me, or is that right. just it just pen, depends? I, I mean, I could jump in that water. So just got to the point where me and my significant other, like, we really ain't got no secret. 
Like, I know some fucked up shit about her. She knows some fucked up shit about me. Okay. So that's what I'm asking. And so that, I kind of think that's why we still rocking with each other. Because we don't feel like ain't nobody hiding nothing. And like it, it might have been something that couldn't have been hidden in the beginning anyway. It might have been something that you were showing. I hear that this is me and I ain't that person no more. You know, or it <coughs> might have been the same vice versa, you know what I'm saying? But I might I mean it's just yeah, I don't no, nah, I can't I don't think here's one thing I don't I, I do know for a fact I don't need to know in regards of who I'm dealing with, if we don't make it and I end up with somebody else, I don't need to know about your past relationships. That ain't I don't give a damn. <laughs> what what if uh so what if her past <laughs> Yeah, I, I might need a little little bit. I, Just a I, little I, background. No, I need a little you don't want a no smidgen. Nothing, no, yeah, no, I, cause all right, let me all right. As far as what I'm saying is, all right, so you I'm saying I don't wanna know. Here's here's my thought process when I commit and this is us and we're in a relationship or whatever. It gets to a point where if I'm if it's working and we together and we're gonna be together, or whatever, I this is how I kind of feel in my mind. I feel like regardless of whatever happened, then none of my business cause it's me and you. I'm you. I see that. I'm you know if I, I mean you that. understand what I'm saying. <laughs> yeah, I understand that. Like but. it's I'm damn that I'm 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 whatever you whatever you went through. It was cause of me. Yeah. That's how I feel. I'm the first. That's how I try to. That's how I my brain is trained. To, I ain't even saying to think, but I try to look at it like that. Okay, I know you did it, but damn them. <clears throat> I don't. If if you don't talk about it, all I know is you know is me. And if we, if I don't talk about what I did, even though we probably talked about it, all you know that I did is you. You know what I'm, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, but I, I feel like some of the information could be pertinent. Could be a little helpful. To my well-being. Mm. That's how I feel. Some of it... I get what you're saying about your well-being, but yeah. I, it's just... And vice versa. It's just certain shit I... You just rather not. You rather not hear it. Even if I know it, you rather not be privy to don't, it. Don't expound. Don't talk to me about nah. it and expound on it and get deep. I it, like you can say such such such. I get. I, I do. I yeah, get that. Yeah. So I, I, I get it. I, I get that. I don't need to talk about it no more. That's it. Yeah. I don't cool. need every like glaring detail. Yeah. But no, not however. That. Yeah, that's exactly what I'm saying. I don't need to know. The however, to the end. Yeah, I, I don't yeah, need to know I, any, yeah, everything I, in between. But yeah. Some shit is pertinent to like. It could answer some questions too. Yeah, it's yeah. it's like you know, okay. I see. I see why we here. Why you why we here, and I see how why you're the way you are. Mm-hmm. And that's important. Yeah. And, and I can make my decisions based off of that information, and vice versa. It ain't one way. It's like yo. Here you here you go. This is me. Now you can. Take, Take it, it or leave it. You know what I'm saying? It's up to you now. And I know I took this a, a whole a sharp left, but you get what I'm saying. Yeah, I understand. I don't need to know like every little yeah. detail, uh, especially yeah. when you're trying because that that says something in it in of a in and of itself that says something when you're trying to tell me every little thing that lets me know that um I might be thrown off because. Yeah. Why are you telling me all of this? And you might not be over certain situations. You might right. need to go to therapy for certain situations. Right. It's and none of my business. Yeah. So, yeah, I get that. And she probably thinks she's going to work it out through you. Perhaps. Mm. But I am not <laughs> <laughs> Dr. <laughs> Phil. So. <laughs> not qualified for that, this position. Yeah, yeah. So. But I get it. I, I do get it, man. It's, it's crazy how. This whole human interactions be, man, and how we like base, how we interact with one another, man, where it's like um, homies with homies and or like women with women or you with your significant other. It's, it's, it's just 
And it's, it's crazy because it's, it's, it, it, it's all, levels, right? Mm-hmm. And it based it is a lot of it's based off of all right, you was raised this way and you've seen this in your time and then but the shit you seen ain't got nothing to do with what yeah. I did. But now we trying to be together or be friends or whatever. You know what I'm saying? It, it's just the trying whole to counteract. Life. Yeah. Each other's uh, right. personalities and experiences, and it gets deep when you mm-hmm. do that. And I think me and Raul talked about that last night on our podcast, <laughs> the Raul and Art Pod. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we got a, a spinoff already. Yeah, we kind of talked about that last night. How, um, like, what? This is a question I asked. We can throw it back, you know, in hindsight type thing. What is one characteristic or that? Your significant, like if you met a lady, what is something, one characteristic that she would have to have for you to be with her or have to do for you to be with her? And he said she can't be a square. And he, what he meant by that was she has to be of the culture. She has to understand like where he's coming from in some capacity. And I understand that. <clears throat> I understand that 100%. And I ain't trying to throw you under the bus, Bo. <laughs> but. And, yeah, but. And I'm not calling you a square, but you such a nice dude that I feel like sometimes it be some shit that you miss out on because you such a good dude, if that makes sense to you. To miss out on Yo, you might not understand or you might not see it. Cause you you one of the nicest people I have met in my life, dog. <laughs> I'm I'm gonna blow up your spot. But just because I'm nice to y'all don't mean I'm nice to everybody. Nah shit. Nah, nah. You, you can't turn that off. You are you, you, you are, can't turn that off. You are genuine yeah. like a real like good dude. Like, I don't I don't even know how they cre- what I don't know what kind of upbringing you had to get you to this point. But yeah, you 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 a good dude, man. I think it goes back to like when we harking back to one of the earlier segments of this podcast where we was talking about like the family dynamic. And I think that has something to do with it, man. He has, he's a good he's a real solid dude, man. He he mm, Okay. You harking back to the fi- family dynamic. I had that family dynamic, but I was but seeing you, something else and I was like, yeah. yeah. Bro. You might have been rebellious. Yeah, uh, I, I, but I wasn't a bad kid. That's what I'm saying. I, I just, uh, yeah. But yeah, I'm I'm Ooh. so happy to say that you. <laughs> I don't, but I don't understand. Job. I want to understand what you're saying. Like, how you saying? Like, I think my man like peeps shit out because he because we have conversations where he we me and him talk and we you know he peeps some he peeps certain shit out from certain people. But then it was certain things that. <laughs> Like it ain't it only had to be within our circle. It it might be some just general shit, and he'd be like, "What the fuck you talking about? What is that?" Like he he just he is in a good space where he ain't got to be, be to all aware the, of all that other. some other shit that's going on. Oh, that's good though. That's a good yeah. Thing. That's what I'm saying. I, and I'm like, how do you do this? How are you able to do this? Where do you get this? Where did this quality come from? And you can continue to have it in 2021. I wish more people had it. Uh, yeah, that, <laughs> it would be a positive if more people had it. For sure. So, I don't even know what point we was making. Yeah, I... But, I, I was saying I'm a good dude. Bo a good dude. No, before that. Even before he <laughs> brought that up. I don't even know why he brought like, that up. I, I know I went somewhere else. What were we talking about? I completely forgot. Yeah, y'all went totally. The Reggie be hitting me sometimes. Y'all went totally. Yeah, I'm on that ENJ too. The EXO, by the way. Uh, damn. Not this ain't EXO. This is a. Uh... What did we? What were we talking about? Good dude, tell me what we were talking about. Before I was talking about how good you were. You threw me off right there. We have to cut all this shit out. <laughs> <laughs> nah, we leave this in. But we was talking he about He is a super good dude Nah you just making up stuff I forgot what the fuck We was talking about We were um Damn I did too That's crazy 
Oh, the secrets. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. That's what it was. <laughs> secrets and telling people your secrets, man. It, would you tell your significant other your secret or? And that's how I came to the conclusion about how he's such a good dude. I don't think he's gonna have that many secrets. Mm. <laughs> don't try to make yourself something you're not. Mm. Everybody got their secrets. Yeah, I don't yeah, think. Man. I don't think it, they might only different. It's just my. For me, from the outside looking in, how long I've known him, I just don't think. Everybody got their secrets. I think only, they might only mind. be different in degree. Yeah. yeah. I don't think he's going to blow nobody's mind. He's going to be like, yo, I said, said, said. And I'm like, word, I did that yesterday. <laughs> you, know, you know what I'm saying? Oh, no. Nah. He might do some shit that he regrets or vice. You know, he might have been put in yeah, some situations. Yeah. You don't never know, but it's a secret for yeah, a reason. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Keep thinking like you think. <clears throat> yeah. And you and gonna keep, keep being a good dude. Yeah. That, yeah. That's how we gonna keep rocking. As long as you don't put no knife on my back, I ain't got to put no hands on you. <laughs> Golly. But yeah, that's about it. Yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't. I'm telling you, you keep being the good dude. I think you are, and don't try to make yourself out of something else. When you just like, I keep thinking like you thinking, and so you got you keep rocking like we rocking. Got secrets that you would take to the grave and not even tell. Yeah, a significant other. Nah, uh, nah. Mm-mm. I don't think it's nothing we ain't talked about. Nah, if I haven't, if I end up with some, if we don't. End up together till I'm in the grave. I might reassess what I got to say to whoever it is. But do you bring up stuff? As far as a, who I'm with now, I think I ain't talking about with, everything. I ain't who you with now, but like, do you bring up stuff that like you with somebody, right? Talking mm-hmm. to Mike. Huh? You bring? Do you bring up stuff that's like years and years back? It eventually comes up. But I'm speaking I'm on... I'm saying you bring it up. No, I'm speaking on who I'm with now. Just based off of her personality and... Well, see, y'all been together. The mm-hmm. person she is. And we've been together for Forever. a long yeah, time. Yeah, so I think that, that plays a different part in yeah. it, too. So it might be some shit and... If something. you meet somebody, though. Let's say if you meet somebody in the, in, the, in the next few years, y'all done got cool or y'all done got good. Do you bring back stuff that was 15 years ago? That may, you know what I'm saying? Depends on how we come upon how it. How we, yeah, how, how, cause like it's been stuff I told y'all that y'all didn't know, but it wasn't stuff that I jumped out the window and was like, hey, look at, check me out with her. You know what I'm saying? But it that type of stuff a, is it, different it when was, it comes it to It took a while for me to be like, well, I'm comfortable with these niggas. I, but you know, stuff like that can be different when it comes to a significant other, cause they'll be like, why didn't you tell me this before? Yeah, but but if it's they should understand like it takes a time to get to certain points. Yeah, you right. Know? I'm just saying, it's you like, gotta get comfortable. You gotta get comfortable <laughs> enough to say some stuff that you ain't gonna normally say. And when you, I feel like when you feel like you have that comfortability to say what it is, they should be accepting of it, regardless they like it or not. They they should be accepting of the fact that you said it. And they might have to deal with it, and it might take a while for them to deal with it, but they, they, it shouldn't be nothing. It shouldn't be turned into a problem. Let me ask y'all this, though. Do, are y'all good at keeping secrets? Or would you rather not even know? Like, don't tell me no know. shit. I'd rather not know. Yeah, I'd definitely rather not know. I really you know, <laughs> if, that's, if that's the easy way out, I'd rather not know. But, yeah, I ain't got no problem. If you tell me something and you just, just like, trying to Yo, get up your chest. It's between me and you. Yeah, yeah I'm, cool. I'm cool with that. But I'd rather not know. Because you putting a burden on me at the end of the day. Depending yeah, on who it is. Like yeah, it depends on who it is. I'd yeah. rather not know. Depending on who it is. Like, you know what I'm saying? If you my, you know what I'm saying? Like, then, yeah, okay, you could tell me, but you just. Depends on a certain type of social that you are. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, don't, Somebody else might find out, bro, but I'm going to tell them, like, hey, bro, don't say nothing. I'm about to But that's this. what. <laughs> <laughs> that's Keep when the shit go left, though, yeah. and it go around the world. Nah, but there's certain people that I know I can say, look, between me and you, 
I tell you something, it shouldn't leave this room. It's certain people I can say that too, and I feel confident in saying that too. So, why do you think it's so hard for people to hold a secret though? Mm, depend on what it is, one. But what what is it? Depend on what it is, and depend on who told them. Like secrets never. Get- some people wanted them air some people out, and it's some people that hear some shit and they be like, "Oh, word." Mm-hmm. I I got you. And as soon as you leave, they. Mm-hmm. Cause as soon as you say between me and you, yeah, they is red, like, they oh, is. Mm, mm, can't wait. But yeah. what is, what is it in like psychologically that makes people do that? What is that? So I, everybody different, though. Everybody built different. Nah, cause it's a yeah. I get that, but secrets are like like promises get broken for a reason, and secrets get spoken. Outside of the circle, f- that happens often. What is that though? Because people be itching. Like it's like people can't hold that shit. We see it all the time. Like you know what I'm saying. And it gets back to you, and it's like a whole nother. It ain't even the same fucking s- secret that you told to the person. Yeah. There's some mm-hmm. other yeah. shit added on to yeah. it, and subtracted yeah. from it, and you know what I'm saying. Like yeah. I wonder lot, what that is. Of, That's like human psychology is crazy to me. I tra- travel way faster than the truth. So yeah, I wonder what that is that that makes people want to like just blurt out or tell somebody else like they can't keep them it to, to themselves. Stay relevant or them to stay, seem cool to some people. It's harking back. Probably did a couple days. Attention. Mm-hmm. People seem cool. Or... Attention. Okay. Yeah. Attention. That's a good. That's a good one. Attention is attention. Because now they're taking it. Okay, I got this. Yeah, I got some information that you yeah. ain't privy to. Let me put it in your ear. Yeah, so I, I can see like, that. Cool yeah, now you know I know. Oh, I need to go holler at you when you because you, you, you know some shit I wouldn't know. You, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's I can attention. See and that harkens back to that shit might be the new currency for business. real. Dog. Hmm? That shit harkens back to mind your business. Well, well, yeah, but if you get told a secret, then you was kind of minding your business, and somebody no, told you their business. Like, people like to mind. Some people like to mind their business. They don't want to be told. Oh yeah, 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 you know yeah. What I'm saying? I got, I got you. Yeah. So, I don't, man, I don't know, man. It's it's crazy, and you like you said, attention, attention is crazy because you can get it. You can tell that one person that you might. It's a whole lot of variables might go into that. You're trying to get cool with somebody else and you tell them mm-hmm. the secret. And now it's a whole nother thing and blew up in your face because yeah. you done told somebody else the secret that only you were supposed to know. Tense. Moral of the story is, man, just keep your secrets to yourself, man, because you can't trust nobody out nobody. here. Nobody. You know what I'm mind your business. Your friend might turn into your enemy. Your girl might turn into your biggest hater one day. You shouldn't tell her your secrets. <laughs> <laughs> She's gonna wear you out. Yeah. I'm, just, I'm playing, man. I'm playing, man. If you feel comfortable enough to tell your secrets, man, tell your secrets. The person that's listening to your secrets, keep it a secret. Yeah. They told you that in confidence. Act like a psychiatrist. Act like uh, Doctor Phil. Just be a good listener. Be a good listener. Be a shoulder to lean on. Cry on if need be. Don't go out here t- all willy nilly telling people secrets. Don't be pillow talking out here when you move on to the next man or the next woman. That's some whole shit. Anyway, if you have made it this far, man, I go by the name of artwork, man. Look at, I'm a 336 legend, baby. I mean, look at that. <laughs> you already know Bo in the building. See both Y'all see that shirt that Do shirt. it again Do it again Do y'all see the detail Yo. on that Yeah Come Coming soon Hit us in the DM Cause mm-hmm. it ain't on the site yet Nah It might not ever be on the site It's exclusive But I go by the name of Art Word And we are the legendary visionaries This is the Legend Has It Podcast Make sure you read a book B We out Holla. Yeah <laughs>